everybody. You got some big news. Yeah, I was just about to head over, set up for the party. Aren't you coming? Yeah, it's a whole lot of lifting. It's not really my thing. And I don't know if I just mentioned this, but I have some big news. Yeah, so I heard. What's up? Well, Ryan, I'm a man now. And not just like an after your bar mitzvah man, but a man man. I had sex with a girl. Summer, to be more specific. How was it? I had sex. Not bad. No, not that bad. It was just kind of weird. Mm, weird. Yeah, but not kinky weird, more like weird, awkward. But hey, you know what? It was my first time. She's a more experienced woman. That's to be expected. And I did make some faces in the middle that I wish that I could uh, take back, but I can't. And there's also sort of a whiny noise that came out towards the end that uh, probably wasn't my finest hour. And I sucked so bad. I was like a fish flopping around on dry land. Ryan, I was Nemo, and I just wanted to go home. Well, don't worry about it. You'll get another chance. Yeah, that's the thing, though. I'm not sure that I will. The situation with Summer's murkier now than it was before the awful fish sex. I wouldn't refer to it as fish sex ever again. That's a good point. That's something that I was hoping to get a little bit more of. Uh, tips, tricks of the trade. I think Summer's used to driving a higher performance vehicle. Yeah, I don't know if I'm the guy to talk to about romance these days. Why? What's up? Yeah, me and Marissa, it's, it's definitely different now, post-Oliver. Yeah? You want to talk about it? Nah, I should get over to set up. Hey, so, do you have any tips or words of wisdom for me? Do it again. That's what I was afraid of. How long will this continue? You've ruined my favorite holiday. So, until Valentine's Day is over, we have nothing to talk about. All right. Hey, Dad, are you busy? I'm just enjoying your mother's company. Awesome, I need to talk to you. What's going on? Nothing, just need to talk to you. Uh, girl stuff? Well, you've come to the master. <laughs> hey, I got you. I was young, impressionable, and drunk. Yeah, only child, right here. I'll get it. I need a little fresh air. Well, I never thought that I would have to say this, but I think that we need to have the talk. No. It's going to be as hard for me as it is for you. Well, did, did you, uh, you know, did you wear a protection? Oh, oh my God, yes. Oh my God, yes. I don't believe you just asked me that. Oh, well, I'm sorry, but I had to. It's so good that you did. If you're going to have sex, you've got to be responsible. Yes, responsible and awkward. Whoa! Well, that's to be expected. It is? Yeah. See, that's what I thought. Hey, listen. You were lucky to be able to hang in there after all that foreplay. For what now? Foreplay. Oh, uh, yeah. Y you know, um... Massaging, you know, or, um, you know, nibbling the neck. Look, here's a point. Just because you're ready to go, it doesn't mean she is. I'm always ready to go. Oh, you're my son. We Coens are very sexual beings. Oh, my God. Viral. Get used Just to it. It's disgusting. Foreplay, huh? Oh, I'm telling you. The appetizer is as good as the main course. Yep, just swallowed a little bit of throw up. Well, I'm gonna pretend we never had this conversation, but thanks, Dad. Hey, Seth. Seth. So, am I, am I asking who'd you, who'd you uh, who'd you sleep with? I mean, you got so many girls these days. Summer? Who you dog you? <laughs>